Hey you guys, DarkseyDex here with another Dota 2 replay. Today I am playing Abaddon. Tanky Abaddon as well, I'd like to say. This guy said GG. Anyway, I skipped the laning phase. I'm building Tanky here. I mean, I'm, I don't really know if my item build is perfect in any way. I was just... I'm, I didn't follow any specific guide or anything like that. I just... I just easily shoot him down like trash. Hold on, let's see it again. Sven, piece of shit. One, two, wait, yeah, oh, oh no, oh, oh, oh no, 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 not even, that that didn't do it justice. Let's see it one more time. There he is, thinking he's smart, faceless hemorrhoid, he has no health and he's staying out of tower, and oh, oh, you're a piece of shit. You will not be missed. Anyway, I don't actually get a lot of kills in this game, I actually think I get more deaths than kills, so it's pretty bad, but, uh, I felt like my main goal was to stay in the battle long enough to make bad guys waste their abilities and then when I die the team cleaned up which nine times out of ten this worked pretty well so I'm pretty satisfied with my overall uh, thingamabob my overall but anyway we just finished well, we, yeah we destroyed the first bottom tower so me and kid Starstorm here hey, my my constant sidekick <clears throat> we go and decide to take more objectives on the map and we do we pretty much just go through the just go through the paces. Then we're like, oh, let's go top, and then we, we didn't even realize top tower was already gone. But it was good to get to rendezvous with our team. Let me speed this up a little bit here. Eh, it's mainly me running right now. I have phase boots. I love this fucking magic wand. I swear by it now. And a salve. I got an ogre club. Just opened an ogre club. No, no fucking goblins allowed. VIP, ladies' night. Women get in for free. Let's do it. Deuce, 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 deuce. Or is that, that's just a big ass axe that Ogre uses. Yeah, it's not, it's not that kind of Ogre Club. Well, fuck that then. Fuck that shit. So, yeah. And Chance just bought her boots. So it's kind of late, but whatever. <laughs> now we're just, we're going to push the top lane here. I'm pretty sure that these guys try to get the jump on us. They don't do a very good job of it. As you can see, I'm wearing the sermon of the frozen apostle shit, except for the shoulders. The shoulders are ugly as fuck. This little motherfucker thinks he's cute. And this, what I love, is you'll see in this game, he always goes for me, and then I just F, I, 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 ulti, I ultimate, and I'll get fully healed. I should have been hitting Sven. I should have been hitting, wait, do I start hitting Sven? No, I just die. I'm pretty sure I die here. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, that, I denied the, I denied him, like, death. <laughs> that was actually a nice move on my part. I don't know if I did it on purpose or not. I, I, I wanted to learn this little move. If you use Miss Oil right before you die, then, uh, like, if it does enough damage to kill you, you will deny the enemy experience and gold. So, I try to save my Miss Coil as, like, my final attack. Like, I'm gonna die, eat shit, bam! And then I just fucking hit him with the Miss Coil. And they're done. They're fucking done. And, I, and I'm done too, but they don't get any of the goodies for killing me, which is nice. I'm, I'm about that. I'm about that. You don't want the bad guys getting anything from you. So that's a neat little Abaddon trick I learned from research. Uh, bottom tower me getting back to the top. I should have bought a scroll, but I'm a dumbass. I had way more than enough gold. <laughs> Although I think I'm, I get very stubborn with my gold, I don't know why, I think it's because because I feel like I'm trying to save for a mithril hammer right now, and I'm like, I don't want to spend any fucking gold, fuck this shit. Tanking a tower like a boss, don't even give a shit. Coming back for it. There's this idiot again. And, oh, he gets him this time. I think, I get away actually. I get away for something slick. I'm, I don't know, like, Abaddon is such a great hero for getting out, just the phase boots and his speed, he's just so fast. So, I, uh, a three-on-one, nice close call right there. I get the fuck out. <laughs> I really wish I could zoom in on, uh, Hero Chase, but it doesn't let me. Because so I'd really like to show off this set I got, it's nice. It's got a nice looking sword, and although the sword isn't showing for some reason right now, maybe I'm not attacking. Either way, they're going for we're going for Roche. It's a terrible. I actually was pretty pissed off that we tried to do this because I knew we were going to get ambushed, and lo and behold, we get fucking ambushed. I think a lot of us die. I'm pretty sure I make it out because I'm fucking Ab Abaddon. Actually, I don't know. Is it pronounced Abaddon? Because like in the beginning of the replay, he said when I when it, when it picked my hero went Abaddon. I was like, oh, I thought it was Abaddon. Oh. 
Okay, that was a that was a oh actually it looked like good timing on my part as I get fully healed. Now I'm just I'm just swinging wildly at anyone I can find. Yeah, I'm trying to kill that fucking faceless void. He's he's one of the problems. Oh no, my f there we go, there we go, and dead. I should have <laughs> should have queued, should have queued, bro, should have queued. I didn't queue though. Q is my missed coil, which is my deny ability. Anyway, now that I'm dead, I don't really care. I don't care, I ain't even going to the other players. Here I am, standing around, I finally got my Ogre Club Morbid Masks, and I got a little uh, Life Steal. I like Life Steal, I'm a fan of it, a big fan of it, especially when I'm, when I'm building a tank support. So, I pick one of these up. I think I pick up the Vladimir's Blessing, although I kind of wish I got the uh, Berserker Mask. It is to be like an easy way to, to self-proc my ultimate. Watch as I heal, and then I bait, and then I run. That's what I do, people. As long as they're not focusing on lion, I'm good. <laughs> and my aphotic shield pops. Is it called an aphotic shield? Aphotic shield, yes. <clears throat> Running up the fucking middle here. Trying to get some creep farm for myself. Nothing interesting, honestly. Let's see, uh... Actually, you know, our team... Actually, in general, the teams in this game are very disorganized. Faceless Void on top. This guy here. These guys there. Our team, we got one... Two guys in the middle. We got uh, Enchantress over here engaging. I never understood why... I don't know if she actually is engaging, but she's about to get engaged. Very stupid on her part to be running down there by herself. But, regardless, this team was all half-assed, and... Watch as a tower refills my health. Tanking a tower like a champ. Like Abaddon's do. And this thing doesn't stand a chance. Just a waste of a glyph, honestly. And now we got this uh, chainsaw asshole getting his ass whooped. Good night. Good fucking night, son. You come back, though, and it's all good because we're ready to kill you again. This idiot comes in. I think he actually gets me this time because my, yeah, my ulti is down, so he kills me. But uh, let's, let's stay in on the fight here. I'll click Lion. Kill, kill Sven. He, he's like one of their carries. So that's good. And Faceless and Sven are dead, so now they're basically screwed. Well, I mean, Invoker usually causes a threat in any game I play with him, but he wasn't really a big deal in this game. He was always running around the map doing dumb shit that nobody... You know, like, what, what are you doing over here? Like, get the fuck out of here, man. We're, we're about to storm your base, and he's down here. He was probably just a bad invoker player. Either way. Go back over to Lion. Might as well look at Lion if we're gonna look at somebody. <clears throat> Boom. Getting tank in a tower. Like an idiot. Yeah. But he always carries he carries a whole bunch of healing cells. Kinda I mean his Abaddon I don't have to worry about that shit, thankfully. Oh, have uh, Invoker decided to come back to base? Anyway, I'm back. Standing here. I think I'm about trying to what am I trying to build now? I make a ring of Basilius and a regen ring. I'm trying to remember what I make. It's some other kind of healing item, I think. I don't remember. I don't know if I can remember. I'm actually getting just used to the items in this game. I'm not too good at them, so if anybody has uh, suggestions on a tanky Abaddon a lot of health and regen and just like able to like in this game I can I actually last through team fights actually this is a really funny part the team their enemy team finds me alone and they're still not able to kill me watch as my team look I just stand there I kind of baited but I didn't do it on purpose now they're all gonna beat on me like idiots fully heal me I'm gonna continue to chase them trying to get my team to notice and then I just fall back a bit now my team's here we fuck him up. I actually think I survived this encounter, which is great because I really flubbed hard. This Sven, gotta get rid of him before his god strength gets us in all sorts of trouble. Now, as you can see, I'm like almost fully healed. I wand it. I'm like, and this idiot is just walking around. Yeah, you better fucking walk around like an asshole. I thought that was a particularly interesting part of the game where they're like, oh shit, it's Abaddon, kill him. They can't do it. <laughs> I take take a lot of pride in my uh, in the tankiness of this uh, character. He's a lot of fun. Like Abaddon is always. A... Man, I really wish I could see him right now. This guy respawns in five minutes. Oh, it's the Roshan. I'm like, man, that, that, I get a free heal from the chainsaw spin. That's a slick little maneuver if you need like if you need some help. 
Now this guy is gonna probably clear the whole team. Now actually I get an aphotic shield off on Viper real quick. Bam! And then we start fucking him up. I'm pretty sure he dies, but... No, actually no, we get faceless void, but... I mean, Viper does die, but we get faceless anyway. So... I think it was more of a victory for us, because faceless void's a pain in the ass. <laughs> Plus it looks like we also got invoker. So that, that, that's a nice little bonus. I don't know when we got invoker, to be perfectly honest with you, but he's dead, so... We must have got him at some point. I go to jungle a little bit during the downtime, waiting for our carry to come back. Here's Sven all by himself. Thinks he's slick. However, he's not slick. He's dead. <laughs> so, simple. Simple. Don't 1v1 Abaddon, you fucking fool. I actually, oh, I built the Black King bar in this game. I don't even know why. That was a really dumb move on my part, in my opinion. Because, I mean, usually when I see Invoker, I immediately go, Oh, I gotta make a Black King bar. But I should have realized Sven is auto-attack. This guy freezes you and then just auto-attacks you to death. So, I mean, actually, I mean, Black King bar is useful against some of these guys' stuff. But these two are, like, the main carries. And I should have probably built something like... I Actually, I probably... I mean, since they do so much auto-attack, maybe I should have built a Blade Mail to, like, you know, give that damage back to him. Now, I don't know if that's counterproductive for Abaddon, but I do know for auto-attack heroes, blade males are fucking sweet. So, I probably should have did that, but if, if you know something better, then, you know, just say it. You know, just don't say it like a fucking prick. So, like I said, I'm not really too good with the items in this game. I'm still learning them slowly as I play through. And, uh... Obviously, I built phase boots on Abaddon because... Watch oh oh re hold on re re hold the fuck up. Watch this look at this guy wasting his snowball. Ha ha. I love do oh that was so you know cause that guy was torturing me as Drow in one game. Not the same player obviously, but uh I think I die here. I'm pretty sure yeah I die. Should've fucking queued. It wasn't even on cool. You know why? Sometimes I break down and I get really nervous in team fights, but look at this. Watch as three of them die. Actually, I think more. I think even Invoker gets killed here. Nah, he always gets away, that punk. But either way, look at the results. Four people are alive. Three people are dead. So I feel like as a tank, I'm not too upset about the results of that encounter. And I don't mind dying as long as my team picks up the kills. I don't give a shit. That's my mentality. I just want to win. I just want to fucking... W I just want to win. That's all I want to do. Good lord, he has like no items. A magic wand and phase boots. And considering all the healing cells he's carrying with him, he doesn't really he doesn't really need them. Now phase boots even I don't even know if phase boots are good for I don't know. Oh shouldn't stand in that. Use your use your magic wand. Or use a salve, I guess. I would have used my magic wand. Although honestly the magic wand is really nice to use in, in regular fights. Anyway, I'm coming back out. <laughs> I've been released from the gates. They've released the horsemen. Whole bunch of shit is going on. Again, I get caught in a fucking team fight. They try to disable me. He knows not to hit me. I wasted my ult. I try to get rid of this Sven, but he just fucking destroys me. Alright, Black King barbed. I don't even. I'm not sure. I, I, then I just die. I could have put up a shield. I could have queued. But again, like I said, in these in these combat situations, I, I just choke. I'm like, oh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? It's a very bad habit. But anyway, the whole team pretty much dies here, except for her, who's invisible. And I saw five. I don't. I don't like to spend money on buybacks because I'm trying to buy shit. I got a vitality booster now. I got my Vladimir's offering for the team. That, I mean, since we, I mean, actually, I, it, nobody really had a mechanism for a while, so I was like, let me get a life steal aura. Actually, no, he has a mechanism, but he's always jungling or split pushing like a. I like don't buy a mechanism if you don't intend to be with the team, asshole. So that that guy was actually pissing us off a lot during the game. It doesn't show the team chat, but we kept on telling him, stop fucking solo pushing. We're trying to fucking push the lane. Get the fuck over here. Like Jesus, like we have the obvious advantage. We don't need to fucking fuck around. But either way, he's just doing his own thing, and it's just frustrating for everyone, but whatever. We push a little bit again. That asshole's throwing his stupid chainsaw, but nobody gives a shit. Tusk kept on leaving and coming back, but the Tusk in this game was fucking awful. Yeah, I think he goes 0 and 12 by the end. So, not much to say about him. 
Now this guy does his little uh, thing, but I think he finally... No, he doesn't wisen up completely, because he does try to kill me again later. But what he doesn't know is I'm going to get him anyway. And they can't get me. I'm, I'm pretty sure I last this... What am I doing just standing there? This Sven is going to kill me, as always. Yeah. But faceless, I, Sven did get killed by something. And, uh, again, I think I choke and I don't do it. I'm just trying to run. For some reason, I'm just trying to run away. I should just be focusing on casting my aphotic shield on myself. So, let's see. Now we get, what, are they, what are they? Like, all these, like, Viper's down there by himself. Protect, yeah, well, he's protecting the tower. I guess that's normal. Either way, I'm back now. I, I rendezvous with the kid in the middle, as usual. There we go. Look at that. Boom. Good night, son. JFK right in the back of the fucking head. And this, that fucking tornado is really annoying. I mean, like, really just the most annoying fucking thing on the face of the earth. But either way, there's only two left. This guy's got, like, no health. So, he's probably just gonna retreat. I'm gonna try and get some lifesteal health. Although I'm not attacking fast enough, I probably should have got some attack speed items. Maybe picked up a Yasha or something if I wanted to really capitalize on, uh, my mask. Hmm. Which is one of the reasons I was thinking about maybe taking the Berserker mask, because I could go in the jungle and quickly heal up with life steal and that. And then again, I have my. I don't like to, you know, immediately use my ultimate to heal. I like to think that I could heal in other ways. I go for the racks. I'm not even bothering with these guys, because honestly, I just want to get rid of their racks. I toss him a shield, but I continue my rack assault. Then I say, hey, you know what? This guy's a pig. Fuck him. Let him die. Get rid of that shit. And then we go get rid of this shit. I right, stand out of that shit. Probably should have jumped in it and healed myself. Nah, probably not. My BKB is already on a 7 second cooldown. Oh my goodness. Now, I don't want to go in there, but I send a Q in to hit him. He's taking damage somehow. Oh, that guy was hitting him. I should probably heal him, but I don't. I had my fucking borrowed time up and I died, are you fucking serious? Fucking fail. That was fail. That was so fucking bad. Anyway, what's he doing? He's running around. There's my corpse. Okay, these guys... Uh, this is Sven. I, I really didn't like this guy. He was a, oh, he built a Daedalus. He built a Shadow Blade? Interesting choice. Never seen that on a Sven. Okay. Go back to me, because I'm what counts here. Only only thing that matters, man, I'm the fucking guy who owns the channel. I fuck some shit up. That's what I do, people. I fuck shit up. Blah, 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 blah. And then we're gonna go in and fuck more shit up. Oh, right, this is when we start to take down all their barracks. We decide, let's go for Mega Creeps. So we slowly push all their lanes. We'll get rid of this one. Destroy this fucking thing. Slow it down. Slow it down. There's the meatball. I put up my Black King bar as soon as I see that piece of shit meatball. And then after the barracks are down, I, I fucking back. I, I don't I don't even care. I just back the fuck out of there. I don't know why. I probably could have won that team fight if we all stayed. Now, now, now looking back on it, we probably should have stayed and, and killed them all. But either way, either way, Lion heads down to, to defend the base. And I go over here to grab a scroll, I think. Yeah, I jump up that way too. I jump over that way, but then I, I, I forget how long the channeling time is and I try to move. And I'm like, oh, great, I just wasted my scroll. So I don't get back to where I needed to go, and I was pretty pissed off about it. I was like, why does the fucking channeling take so long in this game? Why can't it just be instant? I guess it can't be instincts, it'd be unfair in team fights if it was instant. Because then you could just... Look at how, look at how the, 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 the faster I make the speed, the longer his cape gets when he runs. I was like, I don't remember the cape draping out that far in game, and then I realized... It only look at that, it happens when you make it faster. Then it gets, yeah, it gets really long. It looks like a freaking wedding gown. Interesting. Now we're going for the top racks, and we actually and, the, and it's great because Enchantress was pinging middle, like up there coming middle. I was like, let them fucking have middle. We're about to fucking have mega creeps, you idiot. Fuck middle. Like just like well, I'm not coming all the way back down there. Look now, freaking idiot, faceless void is is fucking hamming on me. And and then look at look look at what he did in the end. He died, and I'm pretty much at full health. Toss up a shield. Time to get Invoker, hopefully. Nah, I don't think we do. He always gets away, so I don't need I'm thinking to myself, ah, hey, he's just gonna get away as always. But he doesn't for once, which is nice. 
But usually when I see Invoker starting to run, I just assume, okay, that was a waste. Another waste of a structure. Damn right, GG, but it ain't over yet. Not till the fat lady sings. And then we just clean up the rest. These guys go into fight. I'm not like that. I I, I hit objectives. It's, I don't know. I don't know for better or worse. I just want to end the game. I say GG as soon as I see all these creeps hitting the tower. And dead. Fucking beautiful. Hold on. I want to see the fucking radiant tower explode in slow motion. Yes, son. Look at that. You can even... Look at that glitchness. That awesome glitch right there. 15. Dead. Boom. No. dead. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. Maybe you learned a thing or two. I know I probably didn't teach I, I, What am I going to teach you guys? I'm, t I'm not that good at this game. Anyway, if you could teach me something, tell me some good items to make. I, I made a Vanguard in the end because I originally wanted to make a Heart of the Tarrasque, but I realized I didn't have enough money to save up for a Reaver, so I just go with this. I don't even know if this is any good for him. I just said, fuck it. It'll soak up some damage and give me some health, so I made it. But anyway, uh, that 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 was this game. I don't. I think I could have made some better item choices. Maybe instead of a BKB, I could have made a Dominator helmet for some armor, or maybe a, a mask for some. Or, or what? I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Dominator helmet is, comes off of this, not the Vladimir's offering. And I didn't regret the Vladimir's offering, but this, with the, with the could have made a scepter, I guess, for an altar. I don't know. You guys hit me up. Let me know what you think. Take it easy.